Hi, I'm Charlie Kasov. I'm a math teacher. And today we're going to learn the, how to find the altitude of a rectangle. Now, the altitude of a rectangle is also known as the height of a rectangle. So when you draw a rectangle, a rectangle is a four-sided shape with four right angles and two sets of parallel lines that are equal to each other. So here and here equal each other, and here and here equal each other. So if we call this the altitude A, the way to find this altitude is either we need to know the area and the length, or we need to know the length and the diagonal. So let's say we know that the area equals 24, and this length here equals 6. Well, the area also equals length times altitude. So it's 24 equals 6 times altitude. And 6 times what equals 24? 4. So altitude equals 4. Now, if we knew the diagonal, let's say we have, actually I'll draw a new rectangle. If we know the diagonal here, and we know the length is, say, uh, 4, and the diagonal is 5, then to find the altitude, we can do the Pythagorean theorem, which is a squared plus b squared equals c squared. And we have the 4, which is a. We don't know b, that's the altitude. And we know c is 5 squared. So we say 16 plus b squared equals 25. And I'm going to bring the work up here. Uh, so 16 plus b squared equals 25, which means that b squared equals 9. We subtract. And that means that b equals 3. So the altitude would be 3. So just to repeat, the two ways to find the altitude of a rectangle are either you know the area and the length, or you know the length and the diagonal. So I'm Charlie Kasov, and you just learned how to find the altitude of a rectangle. Thanks a lot.